Gossips, trending, viral content, celebrity lifestyle. Welcome to. Hello everyone, I welcome you guys to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, I'll be reminding you to subscribe and put on the notification bell. Don't forget to leave a comment at the comment section. Yesterday was one of the happiest moments for Ghana music. Stoneboy pulling a massive crowd at the 40,000 capacity sports stadium in Accra. <laughs> This has ever been the topic for discussion across the world. The first artist who sold out the 40,000 capacity at Sports Stadium in 360 version was Chasni Amamensa Shatawale, which was the Freedom Wave concert on 25th December 2022. This day will ever be remembered in the history books of Ghana and Africa entertainment. We all know what happened causing Shatawale to stop this year's Freedom Wave concert at the Accra Sports Stadium, giving the go-ahead to Stoneboy to move his Ashaman to the world and dim concert to the Sports Stadium. This generated a heated banter and slided afterwards. Stoneboy never disappointed headline his first concert at the 40,000 capacity at Graspo Stadium. It was another history made and a win for Ghana. But the debate on social media has been if Stoneboy's crowd at the stadium matched Shatawale's one in 2023. Videos from Shatawale's Freedom Wave concert 2023 confirms every space and seat at the stadium was filled, making it a 360 version. <laughs> With Stoneboy's one, we could clearly see the place was choked and packed, but portion of the stadium was empty. <laughs> Some also suggest if the crowd that were standing on the third, the place would have been full and had the 360 version. But as it stands, we could see the portion of the stadium empty. Reason some people argue the stadium wasn't a 360 version like Shatawale's one in 2023. There have been so many congratulatory messages to Stoneboy as they did to Shatawale last year. But the particular ones people expected was from fellow industry players, especially Shatawale. Though Stoneboy didn't congratulate Shatawale for filling the stadium in 2023. Some even suggest Shatawale and his fans are envious of Stoneboy for being able to pull this huge crowd at the Babaira Sports Stadium since they thought no artist in Ghana can even go closer to what he did last year. After the back and forth between these two greatest artist fans on social media, Shatawale has calmed things down by congratulating Stoneboy in a more lovely and peaceful way. At exactly 8pm, Shatawale wrote on Facebook, Let us all learn to appreciate ourselves for once and move on. To say congrats to a fellow brother or sister won't spoil anything. I am too focused now to deal in who did it first or last. If we can change our attitude of how we support each other in this music business, everyone will be happy. Yes, Shatawale did it, and Stoneboy has done it too. That should be the glory, not the gory. 10 million lashes, but I no cry. Hashtag on God. Shatter movement. I came here to teach love and not hate. My ways to repair might be harsh, but trust me, that is the only way Ghana music will learn and bounce back into the realities of life. Shatter movement, say congrats to Bim President and let him also enjoy his moment in peace. And these are some of the reactions from the fans. Ed Budisani, I think Shatter only wanted peace for long, but his fans way they ginger him, lol. Your fans actually need proper understanding and to know how things go, I mean the woman make is plenty. For saying the Abdullah, I thank your maturity and unwavering understanding of the game. Nana Kwame, he will later this stone and sack again. Very inconsistent. 